Hello everyone. We are starting the very first topic of Python programming. So I'm creating a simple notebook here. And let's start. Let's name this as Python print statement. Okay. Okay, so what is a print statement? Print statement is nothing but a, a print function. You can use this function to print statements. For example, when you write a print statement, it will look like this. Whenever you see a parenthesis in front of any word, you can use or you can call them as functions. What are functions? Functions are just a, a, a box of code. Whenever you call a function, it will execute the code inside that box and it will return an output or it will generate an output. Okay. Print statement. What does print statement do when you use double quotes or single quotes in it and write something? For example, I'm writing here, hello world. Okay. When you run this, it will print whatever you give in this double quotes or single quotes. Let me run this. It will give you an output of hello world. Whatever you write inside double quotes in this print statement, it will print it as it is. Okay. Let's move forward. So if you want to print hello, and world, world should be on the next line. You can use the new line character. For example, if I write hello, backward slash n, and world. Okay, so we are going to use new line character. You can call this new line character. Okay, what this new line character do? It will bring the cursor to the next line. What this means? This means this. All the programs in Python will run left to right. Okay. Every program will run left to right. When it will print hello, new line, what's backward slash n will do. It will bring the cursor to the next line and cursor will be here. Just like when you and press enter in notepad or MS word, it will just bring the cursor to the next line. Uh, in programming slash and do this exact same. You can call this new line character. There are different type of characters in Python. Uh, you can use slash and slash T slash O slash X slash R. There are different type of characters. We are not going to cover all of them, but they are, um, uh, you can use slash T as well. There is one more character that is hello backward slash T word. Okay, so you can call this horizontal tab. Um, have you used tab before on your keyboard? It will give you a space of or an indentation of eight spaces. This will do the exact same. As you can see, there are space between this. Okay, so this is what slash T will do. These are two different um, characters you can use. How this backward slash works, whenever an interpreter see a backward slash, it will check what the next keyword or what the next character is in there. If there is N, it will change the line. It will, it, if there is um, T, it will bring it to the next uh, or give spa eight, uh, eight spaces. Uh, <clears throat> If you want to print a single code or double code, you can use that as well. For example, if you write hello and I want to print hello with double quotes. So what we can do, we will write a backward slash and then add a double code, backward slash and double code. Okay. What this will do, this will give you an uh, double quotes as well. You write this as you can see this will print double quotes 
if you want to print backward slash you can use double backward slash for example like this okay so first backward slash is for the new uh, for the characters and second backward slash uh, will be printed like this okay so this is how print work okay so let me give you a simple question here so you can use for example let's do some questions number one question or just print the following output the question is print the following output okay so the first very first question is you have to print your name you have to come to the next line now you have to print um, give any spaces eight spaces you can you have to give eight spaces and print your college name and you have to give 16 spaces and you have to print city name or country name okay this is what you have to do it will not work just a second like this so you have to print this okay this is the number one question second question is this you have to print prompt of star the condition is you have to use print statement a single print statement you have to use okay you can use multiple print statements as well okay and the third part is uh, you have to give four spaces then a star in the next line you have to print a star then eight spaces then a star then four spaces then a star so it should look like this okay so these three questions you have to solve so you can pause the video and solve by yourself or you can cross check with my solution so what we have to do is we have to print our name so i'm printing my name that is manshu now i have to change the line so i will going to use backward slash n the new line character now i need eight spaces so i'm using backward slash t so it will give me eight spaces after that i have to um, print the college name but i'm running a company so um, i'm writing the name of my company that is master dexter again i have to come to the next line that is backward slash n i have to give 16 spaces so what you can do is backward slash t backward slash t you can use this two times you cannot do backward slash t divided by two you cannot do this okay so backward slash t backward slash t it will give 16 spaces and you have to print the name of the country okay let me run this you will guide the output like this okay let's come to the second question print statement okay first we have to print a star here we are going to use only print statement this is not for loops we are not considering loops here okay so first thing we have to print a star or asterisk you can say you have to come to the next line again you need two stars you have to come to the next line and you have to print three stars correct let's run this we are getting the same output now we have to print this particular part so how can we solve this in the starting point i told you that whatever you write inside double quotes it will print as it is so if you write hello space world it will print the space as well okay so what we are going to do is there is no such character for printing four spaces so what we are going to do we just give four spaces it will print as it is one two three four first star after this star we have to change the line that is slash n again we need a star we have to give eight spaces we are going to use backward slash t again we need a star backward slash n 
now we need four spaces one two three four and we are going to use a star let's run this you will get the output okay so these are the um, simple print statement there are much more things to use in the print statement like um, how not to change the line so that we will cover in the future sections okay thank you